Howdy folks, this is Jackers back again with another Fallout 4 video, this time with episode 132 of our Let's Play. And uh, we are here at the castle. Now I've been trying to beat back a cold or something for a while now, and I'm having ups and downs with it. Today is a little bit more down than up, so... Yeah, it's uh, well, we'll see how it goes, but there were some comments in the, um, in the comments about how to basically get our settlement size down. So let's give that a whirl. I've not tried it before. But let's give it a whirl. Okay. Okay. Wow. Okay. There we go. <laughs> and uh, God. You would think after all this time, it would get easier. But no. Okay, here we go. Okay, all stored up, and so let's take a look at our settlement size. It's, looks like it's gone down already. Um, that is not what I meant to do. This is what I meant to do. And let's just take out the things we want anyway. Or does it help if I take everything and do it with more things? I'm thinking that might be the actual truth of what you all were trying to explain to me. Hmm. I'm not sure. It looked like it went down more when I just dropped them out of my inventory. But let's see. Maybe that's what I'm looking to do. Okay. I'll probably have to reset my favorites, but, you know, that's not a big deal. And... Back to restoring. It is, it's going down each time I pick a, a weapon up off the ground. Oh, that's pretty nifty, guys. Thanks for sharing that. If I remembered exactly who said that at the moment, I would thank you by name. I apologize that I don't. My memory being sometimes better than others. I just looked before I came in here, too can't take me anywhere. But you guys already know that, don't you? Alright. Once more into the breach, dear friends. Once more close the wall with our English dead. In peacetime nothing so becomes a man as modest stillness and humility. But when the blast of war blows in our ears, then imitate the actions of the tiger. Huh. Okay. So... That, and that, and that, and that, and that. You can tell the ones I've worked on, all the ones with silencers. Okay, and a little Easter egg hunt for grenades in the grass. Okay, one more time just because it is so 
Wait, did I? Yes, yes. So we come in here and we take all this back out. Oh, I love undocumented features. Okay, once more with our undocumented feature and then we will go off and do something, either add more things to the settlement or charge off into the wild and eventually remember which button to push. And they drop like magic. And... Whoops. That console command. Maybe it's my mouse. But I don't think so. It doesn't feel like it. And it's relatively new. But I was having that same issue with uh, Mass Effect where I had to move out. commands off the middle mouse button. Because I kept Something opening the console. Okay, now back into the workshop and, and do the wrong thing once more. Because I'm nothing if not consistent. I don't need the 10 millimeter. I don't need the combat rifle. I'll take my grenades and my mines, my freezing radium rifle, laser rifle they can keep, never ending combat shock on his mind, taking that, taking that. Overcharged Institute Pistol. We were having some fun with that for a while, and I do not need a Super Sledge. But, oh, and it's raining. Awesome. Oh, you know, sometimes the day just works out right. Look at that. We have earned back quite a bit of size on the settlement. Thank you very much, guys. That was an amazingly cool tip. I'd seen people talk about something like it before. I am assuming it was this, but I never quite understood it. Like, whenever I tried what I thought I'd read, it wasn't working. But this is really, really rather cool. You know what? I'm going to open the console inadvertently one more time, because reasons. I don't know why I want to do this, but I do. I just want to put a roof right here. Probably can't. Well, that's kind of cute anyway. Can people still fit? Yeah. Now, oh, we actually, you know what? What would be fun? Still only have five people, though. The settlement needs to run for a while while we're not banging around in it, I guess. But maybe, I don't know, maybe this is something we can do and maybe it's something we can't. Um, have to see. No, maybe this is a better answer. And can I? That's really what I want to do. Maybe I can. Just want to cover that ground there. So here's my thought. I don't know if anybody will do this or not. But, give a little bit of overwatch to our to our folks down there. Maybe, maybe, maybe they'll use that, maybe they won't, I don't know. Let's, uh, let's just bridge this the whole way across, since we have material to work with now. Yeah, there we go. And a little defensible position and good times.
get the feeling. No, I was gonna say we can add some more turrets, but that might not be necessary. How bad is this? Could they fall in there? Yeah, they could. Okay. Maybe, maybe, maybe though. Instead of this. Um, we did this before. There. Now we just make a little bridge to the bridge. Okay. Is our, is our little thing over there transmitting? Calling the peasants? Calling all peasants? I say, peasants, are you coming? Yeah, it looks like it. And who was it that said they're not even breathing hard? I heard you back there. Okay, um... Got that down there. Hmm. All right. Can they fall in that one? Yeah, okay. Well, you know what? It's not hard to do. So we will put our little staircase bridge here. And now I want to be all like OSHA on them. So... Yeah, let's use the long ones. As he falls off the bridge. walls. Like half high walls. Give some appropriate cover up here. Yeah, I guess we could improvise half high walls. What do you think? with your friends. There you go. And we'll fill that in with... Hmm. We'll fill that in by doing that. Okay. So we've got some fighting positions prepared up here with cover for folks who want to duck. And now let's go ahead and give them a roof over their head too. Because who wants to be on guard duty? and getting all wet at the same time. Okay. That was a really, really great tip, guys. I really, really want to thank you for that. And for everyone who's ever tried to explain that to me and I was too obtuse to figure it out. That was really quite cool. Okay. Wow, we could... We could go absolutely crazy with this. That's awesome. Nice little turn, just to slow the momentum down. And... Yeah. I probably was thinking this would make a good escape route if someone got caught here and they were charged and overwhelmed they could pull out. It also makes a place they could be attacked from behind. Yeah, well, you know, you can't win them all. If there's a stack of bodies, next time we'll know I made the wrong choice. As long as there are bodies. If it's a stack of the other guy's bodies, then I did okay. Okay. 
you know, we have done quite a bit here at the castle. I just kind of feel like going on walkabout. Let's go see what on earth we have going on in the wide, wide world. Talk to the settlers at County Crossing. Well, let's head over to County Crossing. Maybe we'll get some settlers at the castle while we're away. Oh, that's right. I dropped all my weapons. I'm not using anything right now. Is everything back where it should be? No. Okay. Um, hmm. Okay, and this should be here, and it, that one actually did seem to be there. Okay, well, that's good enough for now. And, except I think we should be on this. Yo, before you go to bed, you there. No, no, no. Uh, Hi. Get up, dude. We could really use your help. What's going on? Yes, I'm here to help. What's going on? There's a group of raiders that won't leave us alone. Stealing our food and supplies, threatening us if we can't give them what they want. We know where they're coming from, but we can't stand up to them ourselves. Okay, well, don't, don't worry. worry about it. I'll take care of those raiders for you. I hope so. We didn't know what to do. Okay. Now, let's head over to... Maybe not right up to Revere Beach Station, and certainly not Revere Satellite Array. That could be awkward. Oh, we're this close. Let's just walk over there. And our super secret, sneaky, stealthy black railroad power armor with the bright glowing light. And special clanking attachment. Oh, we've been detected by something. Oh, recon scopes are so wonderful. Yes, something has noticed me. Chameleon combat armor left arm enemies have a harder time detecting you while you are sneaking and not moving. Oh, sure, we'll take that. And hub flower. Sometimes you just need to grab a hub flower. Hey, look, there is the Brotherhood and their fantastic flying machines that they only semi seem to know how to operate. What is hanging in the air? Seriously. Oh, I guess we can give the Brotherhood a hand. Clap, clap, clap. Well done, boys. Love those recon scopes. Ah, you move too much. Well, now you feel better about it, don't you? It's as if I'm not moving at all. I heard something. It was just a bullet whizzing by. And 
plasma infused assault rifle for the win. Yes, by all means, beat your breast and tell me how tough you are. What? Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Sorry, I thought the Brotherhood there was firing on me. But that is a different lifetime. Long ago and far away. Okay, but we have taken a walloping from that nuclear blast while I was trying to figure it out. Let's get over here. Oh, you know what? Who doesn't need a Deathclaw stake? And, hmm, even a Mirelurk Queen steak. Sometimes you just need steak. Lost visual. Should we sneak up and steal her uh, power core? Just for fun. <laughs> Maybe if she looks behind her, she'll think that we're just like a shadow in our black armor. Of course, I'm terrible at pickpocketing, pickpocketing, so we... Oh! Oh, bummer! Well, two, three, or eight rounds, four fusion cells, Brotherhood of Steel hollow tag, and a T60B torso, left arm, left leg, right arm, right leg, and a helmet, and a laser rifle, and a uniform. You know... Sometimes hanging around where the Brotherhood doesn't do so well turns out pretty well in the end anyway. All right, back down into stealth, over to Revere Station. If I could only have convinced her she needed to follow her shadow. Okay, I think we should probably kill the light as we try and stealthily whack a bunch of raiders. Okay. Huh? Not here, Brotherhood. I think she's actually firing at these guys. Oh no, they got her? That's a bummer. I hope not. That's nice. You can't trust me, though. 6308 rounds? That's good. Did you just scuff my armor? Oh. Oh. Oh, oh, baby. Where is this person with their grenades? You know what? You're scuffing my armor and you're ticking me off. Yes, let's. Okay, why am I carrying too much now? Because my armor is broken, perhaps. I think that might be the reason. Yeah, I've lost. Mm. Oh, he's above me. Okay, well... It's going to be a little slow, but we'll get there. And we're going to take your toys on the way. No reason to be stealthy now. chest right at the moment, being overloaded and broken. 538 rounds, frag grenade, stim pack, and the stuff reload. 
take a quick look at the duffel bag. 1050 caliber rounds, 1245, 1038, thin beaker. Oh, I guess we can pop it. Let's. I didn't check for trap. Sweet. Good thing there was one. Wasn't one. 308 round, 17 bottle caps. So we'll take their tokens too, just to be that way. Hey, and we just hit level 50. I'd like to thank your headless corpse for that donation. So dim pack, more tokens and things and stuff. And you may have broken my armor, but that's not enough. What do we need to do exactly? We need to go in there, really? There is a repair station. Hmm. Huh. And I think... Okay, this shouldn't work. But... Um, let's see, I'm missing a left arm and a right arm. A left leg and a right leg. It'd be hideous. But can I move again? I can. All right. Now. Nobody asked you. Okay. In our two-tone armor, we'll go visit the folks in Revere Beach Station. Okay, so here we go. Revere Beach Station. Let's take a quick look inside, but we may... Was there? I think there is something. Oh, wait, we're not. I forgot again. Not everything is equipped. Let's just do that, shall we? Something is popping around back there. Let's give it a little warm welcome. Okay. So, let's get to something a little, what was bouncing around back here? Rad Roach. Okay. And, Subway Token, 1050 caliber round, sugar bombs, typewriter, plastic fork, nothing. Okay, okay, okay. I was totally not just thinking about that. Okay, I would take it, but I think I'm right on the razor's edge of being overloaded. So, let's take a look. Um, yeah. <laughs> 335 out of 335, I would say I'm right about there. Okay. Oh, didn't mean to do quite that. Okay, then. Let's come over here. Now, I don't want to pick things up, so I'm not going to tempt myself. Just want to kind of clear a position for us to hold until next time. Bobby pin box, we can take that. Okay, there's a trap on that, we'll leave that. There's a trap over there, we'll leave that for right now. Because at this weight, even taking the bits from the traps will probably be enough to overload me. Pretty more money should be fine, though. Okay. So, let's swing back this way. Trying to get a look at what that red thing is right there. But 
So we have some raiders we need to deal with it down here next time, and we will do that next time. Nuka Cola Quantum. Oh, so tempting. But because my railroad armor is damaged and we can't quite carry the load we would normally carry, I think we are going to stop here. And we'll. I guess what I can do is in between episodes, I'll bounce out quick and drop off some stuff, maybe repair the T-51, and then next time we'll start up again right here and finish our sweep for bad guys. Wow, I've already dropped 200 rounds today from this. Oh, I need to go shopping. All right, anyway, I would like to point out that if you look in the upper right-hand corner, you will see a small letter I with a white circle around it. These are cards and links to other videos that I've made. Also, I have a Twitter link in the description of the video and on my channel's main page. If you're on mobile, it'll be on my channel's about page. I would like to thank you guys for being the best community. Truly, you guys are awesome. You make this an absolute joy to do, and you really helped me out with that tip. I really, really do appreciate that. I would also like to thank you for watching. I hope you found the video entertaining and maybe just a little informative. I would like to invite you to subscribe, like, and share if you so desire, and to ask you, above all, to please take care.